hello guys welcome to my channel you are watching how to fix tech friends in this video i'm going to show you how you can fix automatic repair loop or startup repair all the problems will be solved by seeing this video i will show you four steps by which you can solve this error easily first i should tell you why you are facing this error there are multiple reasons behind this error like corruption in windows file second is corruption in hard disk or failure of hard disk third is sudden hardware changes and fourth is wrong software installation or wrong update of your windows friends you need to shut down your system three to four time as soon as manufacturer logo appears in order to get automatic repair or blue screen which is also called advanced screens if you are able to access your computer then you can hold shift plus restart button and then you can come here then you will see two options or maybe three options like your pc did not start correctly or startup repair could not repair your pc what you need to do is you need to click on advanced options whatever option you are getting then you will see options like this now you need to click on troubleshoot and then click on advanced options now you will see there are six options but you can try this one startup repair you will see please wait this step is works 10 to 20 percent but still you can try because this is easy steps you can follow this this will diagnose your pc and then try to repair your pc now you need to choose your admin account you need to have admin rights enter here click on continue and you will see diagnosing your pc wait for this process to be completed if this step did not fix your issue you can come here again and now you will see the options like this now you need to click on troubleshoot then same option advanced options now we will try the command prompt here now you may have to enter your credentials here you need to have admin rights now you need to perform this command chk dsk space slash f space slash r space and your drive letter it should be a c and d whatever in your case you need to check here your windows drive and this will scan all your hard drives and will repair bad sector and all the corruption inside your hard drives if your hard drive is corrupted this command will repair all your hard drives so wait for the process to complete this will take 15 to 20 minutes but it might take more than this you need to wait for that i am fast forwarding this video you can see here looking for bad clusters in users this will go five stages and you will see after completing this you need to perform one more command to repair your windows corruption this command stands for system file checker sfc space slash scan now wait for the process it will also take you to 100 percent you need to wait for that it might take 15 to 20 minutes depending on your system configuration you need to wait for that I'm fast forwarding this video and click to continue with window 10. And if you are still facing same problem, we have another fix for you. Click on troubleshoot here and now click on reset this PC. And you need to choose here keep my files and remove everything. Keep my files will keep your personal data like like videos. After that, you will see two options here. Click on local install and cloud install you can also try so wait for this getting things ready your data is safe but whatever software you have installed will be wiped out will be deleted but your personal data is safe so you can try this and now you will see more details here resetting will change setting to back their defaults keep personal fire reinstall windows from this device remove all apps and program that did not come with this pc whatever 
software or program you install will be deleted click on reset and this will process will go your system will restart many times just wait for the resetting it it might take two to three hours so make sure you have enough power with your laptop and plugged in with the charger and this will fix your issue and now log in with your credentials your username will be remain same and you can log in if you are still facing same problem you can reinstall fresh window installation i am sharing you the link in description box and you can also try another method i am putting that video link in the description box you can try that if this video helps you hit like subscribe and share Thank you. Thanks for watching. How to fix tech.